the Yamaha, so I want to show you how you have all your files on here now. So I just want to walk you through. It's a little odd, but um, once you learn it, then you got it. So you're going to hit USB audio, which is that button. The USB is obviously there. And then we have to go to select, and which is number one. You'll see the word here. So you go to number one. And then is the USB drive. You've got to enter the drive. So now I'm in the drive, and here's all um, our files that you'll recognize. So let's go to Way Cool Keyboarding, WCK4K1, something we use a lot. So I'm just using the cursor to get there, and then back to the enter. So now I want to go in that folder, and it's already selected Sun Up, but I'm going to just pretend I'm choosing another one. So let's say I chose Lavender. Now here's the tricky one. You see this audio play? These buttons actually correlate with the numbers that you see here, the bottom row of numbers. So that was tricky for me. The audio play is actually this seven. So watch this. Okay, so Lavender's playing. If I wanted to stop it, again, I'm gonna use the numbers that correlate with the buttons that I see here. So I see the stop, and I'm gonna stop it there. So that's pretty much all you need to know. If you wanna get back to where you were, then you can go to, I think, exit, and now I'm back to the other files. So again, I would use the cursors to select, and then go to the numbers. I see this audio play, and I wanna hear Let's Dance and it's gonna start. If I wanna stop it, there. And if I wanna exit and go back to another file, that's where I'll find that. And again, this is on the Yamaha DGX that's in the back room of suite two.